CCP Channel presents Propositional Function and Quantification. Let's talk about the three subtopics. Propositional Function, Universal Quantification, and Existential Quantification. Let's start! Propositional Function vegetables, then she can get a cookie. Annie eats her vegetables, therefore Annie can get a cookie. Consequently, it is considered propositional. Universal quantification. Quiet! For your life. Alam niyo na ano rules ko. No ID, no entry. Pinyon. Sir. Go. Suarez. Yeah, go niya. Here. Sir. Can you ID mo? Do you want to serve? Bawal, sir. Wala. For something to be considered as a universal quantification, a certain standard must be applicable to all. For instance, Professor Box requires everyone in his classroom to wear their ID. It is universal because everyone in that classroom has an ID. Existential quantification. Okay, class, before we start, we're going to have a game first. So this will be the group one, and this will be the group two. Ang pinakauna, makarot, ade. considered as existential quantification, the standard has to be applicable to some and most, but not all. In this situation, the class was split into two groups. The goal was for everyone to finish the peanuts. In Jun Jun's group, not all were able to eat because he ate them all. It is existential because not all were able to eat the peanuts. <laughs>
Thank you for watching from CCP Channel.